Hey, big BCW show this Friday night at the high school. Tell your friends. Don't need a flyer. I go to every show. Wait, is that you? Uh, what do you mean? Facing Mr. CQ in the main event. It's definitely you. Uh, <laughs> I guess I can see the resemblance, but that guy's a huge indie star. Why would he be out here flyering for a show? Hey, is this weirdo bothering you? He's one of the wrestlers. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. Have fun at the show. Yo, I thought wrestlers had money. Why would he be driving around some crappy bug van? See? See? Good point. More proof that I am not who you think I am. Sure. You gotta check out this guy's highlights online. He's going to be a huge star in WWE someday. <laughs> Thanks. That's nice of you to say. I mean about the wrestler on the poster who is, um, definitely not me. Come on. Let's go. Hope you beat Mr. CQ. I can't stand that guy. Well, maybe I'll see you in the crowd Friday night. I mean, he's a fan. As a fan. Uh, definitely not from the ring. Because I'm not a wrestler. Message from July 12th, 2014. Hey, it's your dad. Sorry I can't make it to your first match tonight. Work's been crazy lately. The Costellos have a heck of a stink bug problem. You wouldn't believe the smell. <laughs> but anyway, I wanted to wish you good luck. Don't do anything too crazy and get yourself hurt. But I hope you win. Oh, and we're out of ice cream. So grab some Rocky Road on your way home. By the way, no matter what ends up happening with this whole wrestling thing, I'm proud of you for making it this far. Love you, son. Don't forget the Rocky Road. Hey, I want you to meet Matt Bloom from NXT. Matt, this is my protege, Van Gogh. I'm a big fan, Mr. Bloom. I mean, I've studied all your matches from your run in WWE and Japan. Really great stuff. Thanks. You must be a true student of the game. I try to be. So why do they call you Van Gogh? Are you some kind of artist? Not quite. I gave him that name because everywhere he goes, his dad's old work Van goes. He practically lives in that thing. Yeah, practically. So what brings you out to our show? I'm here to scout your opponent. Cole Quinn. Cole's great. You won't be disappointed. 
I'll have my eye on you as well. Wait, really? You're rustling coal, so it'd be kind of hard <laughs> not to. Yeah, yeah, good point. Well, I should go get ready. It was nice meeting you, Mr. Bloom, and thanks for coming out to the show. Man, good to see you. That that slower old greenie. Tonight's my big chance to get signed to NXT, so don't do anything to screw it up. <laughs> okay, look, I'm gonna give it everything I have tonight, and we'll see where we stand after that. All I know is I'll be standing in Orlando at the Performance Center. You can continue standing in high school gyms. <laughs> we'll see. How about you worry about facing me tonight, instead of trying to get Matt Bloom's autograph? Suck up.
someday we'll be able to afford play-by-play -play announcers. Until then, you're stuck with me, Baron Blade. These two are going to bring the house down tonight which is something they've literally done before when they once had a match in an old abandoned house. These two have the potential to go all night, but I hope they don't because per the school principal, we have a strict 11 p.m. curfew. Mr. CQ is showing why he has attracted interest from promotions all around the world, including WWE. Enjoy him while you can, ladies and gentlemen. This is what BCW is all about. BCW is all about no fancy stage, no flashy pyro, no one butt in their mouth for way too long, well, except for me. Other than that, it's all action, all the time, and these guys are two of the best. everyone.
If you're wondering where Mr. CQ's opponent got all these sweet moves, you can thank me after the show because I trained him. If I can have your attention for a second, whoever has a red pickup truck with the license plate OCS 732, you're blocking the school nurse's car and she'd like to go home now. There's so much at stake in this match. Let's just say you never know who's watching at a BCW show. Good match, Van Gogh. Yeah, great Thanks. job out there. It means a lot coming from Orlando, you. Orlando, here I come! I'm gonna get a condo on the beach. There's no beach in Orlando. Well, then I'll make sure to furnish my condo with wall-to-wall -wall sand. Before you start making big plans, we have a few things to discuss. Like what? My start date? Future opponents? Waist measurements for the NXT title? Not exactly. To be honest, I'm not a fan of your Mr. CQ character. You need to come up with something different. It's not really a character, but fine. I can come up with something different after I get to NXT. Full disclosure, I don't think you'll be heading to NXT. Not anytime soon, at least. You're just not ready. I was actually more impressed with your opponent over here. Wait, what? So I've decided to offer him an opportunity instead. You'll have a tryout match on an up-and-coming WWE event. Really? Yes. I've been doing this a while now, and I know talent when I see This is some I kind of it. joke. Because you were supposed to be here to scout me and not him. Plans change all the time in this business. That's a good lesson for you to learn. I have to go catch my flight. You and Baron will be hearing from us soon with the details on your tryout match. Don't make me regret my decision. I won't. Thank you. Unbelievable. I told you not to ruin this for me, and look what happened. Whoa, all I did was give it everything I had out there, okay? I can't help it that he saw more potential in me. Potential? Or was it your boy Baron here putting you over with him? I always knew that he was your favorite, but I didn't think it would cost me a shot at WWE. This was all Matt Bloom's decision. Do you think I want to see my top guys leave? <laughs> and do you think we want to stay here forever, wrestling in front of a few hundred people for crap money? That's not what I meant. I'm just saying we're building something good here. Besides, if you left, who would design our title belts? I only make your belts because you pay us so little for wrestling. It's so bad teacher's pet over here has to live in his van. I thought that was a joke. I only live in it when times are tough, which is most of the time. 
Well, that nickname's not as much fun anymore. Look, you just need to trust the process. We're building a brand. And think of it this way. If any of us make it to WWE, it'll be good for everyone. It'll help put BCW on the map and lead to more opportunities. Oh yeah, easy for you to say. You're the one with a WWE tryout match. He's right though. What's the saying? A rising boat will lift all tides? I think it's the other way around. Whatever. Come on, let's drop this thing and bring it in for a BCW handshake. Yeah, no thanks. I'll let you two celebrate alone. Don't worry about him. And congrats! I am truly happy for you!